How's it going everybody? Happy Saturday and welcome back for more Super Mario 3D World. Last time we completed the first level here at World Bowser, Spiky Spike Bridge. And in this episode we've got a couple new levels to take on here and some invisible coins along the way. And a question mark block. Let's hit it, let's hit it, let's hit it. Peach, let's hit it. Alright. So um, yeah, let's go ahead and do Plessy's Dune Downhill and then we will be completing Cookie Cogworks. This is an entirely Plessy-based uh, level, like back at a long time ago. Um, I picked Peach because I'm pretty sure we haven't played as her uh, most recently. Uh, I had a little Sprixy. Uh, I love it. Anyway, let's go ahead and hop on Plessy's back and uh, let's get started here. Um, yeah, this is basically a sand-based level for Plessy. Uh, it's a little different than uh, what we've been used to. I haven't done Plessy in so long, like I have not. Let's hope I can freaking... Get this green star, there we go. Uh, you will be able to knock over all of these uh, stone statues there, just so you know, it's going to be important later. Um, uh, you'll see why in a moment. And we can see our second green star there. There we go, barely got it, and okay. Anyway, let's uh, <laughs> let's head through here. Um, now, for the stamp, you're actually going to want to go in between these Bowser statues. It looks like you might die, but you won't. Everything is going to be perfectly okay there. Um, Clouds will form. It was pretty scary the first time I did that. I was like, uh, uh, uh. Now, anyway, oh god, you want to actually hit this Bowser statue here. And I was gonna say, and what? And but the green star shows up down there. For a second, I thought it came out of Bowser, but I was wrong. The green star shows up there, and there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Probably it's one of the more quick, quick Plessy ones. And he's gonna wave, bye Plessy. Oh, I love Plessy. I was a little like. Bye, Plessy. This little thing wiggles when you talk on the gamepad. Oh, I love it. Anyway, uh, we are Cat Peach, so we should have no problems at all. Let's go ahead and sliddy slide down there. I am Plessy this time. Uh, yeah, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Oop, sorry, I knocked the microphone. Knocked the stand that I have the microphone on, rather. And, uh, there we have it, everybody. World Bowser 2! Because, you know, why the heck not name it World 8? Why just, why not just have it say Bowser on it, I suppose? We get a nice question mark block stamp from that. And, uh, when I'm mad! Oh, I love the, I love the Miiverse post. It's so entertaining. It's a great thing to, that they have decided to put that at the end. Just so it's like, oh yeah, we get to read that now, too. Anyway, ladies and gents, that was pretty quick. And... Oh, yeah! I don't know if you, um, if you're following along with me, you may have taken the time to explore that little region over there. Um, I remember the first time I was over here, I was like, oh, there's gonna be something over here. I thought it was gonna be like a Toad House or a Captain Toad level that would show up, but it is merely a, uh, a spot for this. Anyway, and jump, 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 and jump. Yep, just, uh... I don't know if we've done that in a long time. I think we might have before, but um, yeah, all you gotta do, jump with the downbeats of each measure of the song and you will get the maximum amount of lives. I'm not, I'm still not sure if that's a trick. Eight up? Isn't it normally seven up? Anyway, um, I'm not sure if that's a trick that uh, a lot of people know about, but if you don't, that's what you come to Golden Bolt LP for, isn't that right? Anyway, Cookie Cogworks time. Um, I think we're going to play as my favorite character. Uh, Toad, because I love Toad, and, uh, yeah. I'm really excited to get the Toad Amiibo as well. Um, that's pretty awesome that they actually are having a Toad Amiibo. Um, gotta try and remember where the- I remember where the, uh, most of the star- I believe there's a whole area down here. Uh, we gotta- is this a- is this a big, like, chocolate river- Hey! Oh, I almost died. That was really- that was really bad. I almost, like, just crawled my way right off that. What- Ew, they leave like a gross little, a gross area, ew, like that's, that's kind of nasty. Anyway, uh, I'm trying to remember where the first green star is actually, um, I think that might, I think it's just, um, at a, it's, a, it's at a spot that's like this, I remember, um, oh, I think I know where it is now. Get it! Get it! BAM! And, ew, that's so like, that's really disturbing to know, like, that that's what he, I think it's actually up here. And you can boomerang your way. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Yeah! Alright, this is a very fast moving cogwheel right there. Didn't mean to do that. Anyway. Oh, what a what a bunch of pros right there. Those those guys really know what they're doing. Anyway, let's hop up here and get ourselves the flag. Hello down there. Yes, we can see that there are a whole bunch of piranha plants on those. This is like the most delectable level of all time, I gotta say. Plus the music's wonderful, and uh, 
It's just like, yeah, you're in like a... I, lo I love dessert levels in games. I love that that's like a... Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh, oh, oh. That, 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 what? Toad's a beast, you can't mess with me. Yes, uh, you will notice that the stamp was actually down there. Um, so what you're gonna want to do... Um, is actually take all these guys out. I know, tedious, right? But... You do get a nice reward out of it. Uh, I believe we actually are going to have to do that another time. Get the stamp there. Um, and... I was going to say, and where did we just go? And... Oh, man! We are on fire with this aiming! Yeah, you're going to want to do the same thing here. Um, you don't technically need to, but if you want to be a safe person, it's uh, in your best interest to take out all the little beetle guys. Uh, oh, one lived! One lived! You got a couple of ones that lived here. So let's go ahead and drop down. And we have a question mark block. Let's see what the challenge is this time. I believe it's just running here and not and dealing with these piranha plants. And there we have it there. Don't want to miss that. And there we go. A nice, uh, a nicely earned green star. Ah, uh, isn't it wonderful? Oh, that was really bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah. There we have it, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, you see that platform in the background right there. That is important. Um, because you, this technically looks a lot like the end of the level, so we have to be careful as to not do that. Because long jumping down here will actually bring you to this level right here, in which we're going to have to... My voice is making these things... These things move all over the place, in which we're going to have to actually catch this bunny! I'm gonna get you, bunny! And you get your third green star. Yeah, I know, right? You technically... I mean, that's kind of a weird... It's kind of weird, right? I mean, like, you wouldn't expect you'd actually have to leave the level in order to hit that green star. But anyway, uh, yeah. There we have it. Doing pretty smoothly. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Oh, my God. I thought, I thought for a second, ladies and gentlemen, I thought for a second that that was the end of Toad as we knew it. Anyway, why can't I freaking long jump? There we go. I was going to say, I will not risk not getting the green star after, uh, the gold flag after a run like that. One that I'm very proud to say that I completed. But anyway, yeah, I'm like super excited to have the Toad Amiibo. I don't know why. Like the Super Mario Toad Amiibo. Yeah, you know what it is? I think I'm really excited to just have Amiibos that aren't... Uh, yeah, see, that guy said, where's the third star? It is a very weird spot for it to be. Um, it's... I think I'm just excited to have Amiibos that you're gonna be able to find. You know? Because, like, I am having the hardest time, I'm sure all of you are, too, uh, Amiibo collectors, having the hardest time trying to find guys. Uh, luckily... This world is my favorite. Yeah, it's got the best music in Mario of all time. I would agree with that. Um, oh, we're so close to having an extra life. Dang it. But yeah, I think... There, yep, there's another coin there. I, uh, I don't know. I'm having the toughest time finding Amiibos. I just recently made a purchase of a couple off of eBay. Uh, so... That's where, that's where I'm like, that's a big majority for where I'm getting uh, mine. At least the last two that I've gotten. I was able to get Bowser, though. Um, just from a store, so that's good. Um, yeah. Oh, wait, I remember. Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, you're gonna have to be moving really quick on this one. Um, great, let's get this instead. Now can I, now can I, thank you. I would like the Fire Flower. The Fire Flower is awesome. It's my favorite Mario costume in Smash. In Smash Bros. Oh, no, it's the dweeb guys, the guys who look, uh -huh. but I... I'm getting them before they can even do anything, and I feel kind of terrible about it, because I don't know why I shouldn't. Um, do you have to get rid of the bullies? I don't think you... Do you? I hope you don't have to get rid of the bullies for a star. I don't think you do. But, uh, if you do, I do apologize for that. We will be back, uh, regardless. Want to actually hit the power block here and bang! Got some of those fishies. Uh, this is a... Oh, no, 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 no. I don't think we needed to do that. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, shoot. I'm I'm gonna have to come back. Sorry about that, folks. Uh, there we go. <laughs> I was gonna say, I apologize for that. This is a very fast-moving level. Oh, no! I was gonna say, I think, I think it's just better to have died right there, because, uh, maybe it would've been better if we would've had Toad, or else I was... didn't mess up so much here. Um... That we can get a little ahead of the little ahead of the train. Um, so let's whatever, I don't even care. Um Wow. They were all getting killed there. I wanna stay ahead of the train this time around. Um So let's 
Let's do that. And that was very risky. Excuse me. And yeah, okay, we'll stay we'll stay ahead of the train this time. And oh nice, I didn't actually know that you could do this. Hitting that would give you a golden uh, golden question block to put on your head. I believe was it the um I think it was the uh, new Super Mario Bros. 2 that actually introduced this. That game, man. I don't know what it is. I don't honestly care about these fish that much. Uh they're not they're not all that hard to get, so let's Actually head back here now that I know what I'm doing and get ourselves this and the green star because it's only it only becomes more difficult. You're like, actually you are going to want to do this, <gasps> like I said, uh, or like I showed um, to get the stamp. Um, we're doing pretty well right now. Uh, yeah. So for the third thing, there you go. Kill that fire, bro. And oh, that was slick. He oh he almost got me. No. Let's get that, and uh, let's get this coin up here, and a nice view of Bowser Land from a uh, from a very cool Bowser train that I would li like to ride. Like it's a really cool looking train. I do have to say that. Ah, you again, you with your disappearing. Uh, I would have really hoped that that would have worked. And here she is, right here. Uh, uh, there we go. She's always very easy to figure out, but there are a lot of her this time around. A lot more than, uh, a lot more than the last time, at least. Like, look at how many of there are. About to throw their ninja stars at us, but there we go. Not a very difficult boss, but a fun one nonetheless. That's the thing about 3D World. It's, well, I mean, I was gonna say it's not entirely difficult, but you guys ain't seen nothing yet. Like, oh man, uh, in just a few short episodes, it's gonna get, it's gonna get a little insane. I do have to say that. It will get a little crazy. Uh, yeah. No! What? Really? I was like an instant too close and I was like, God dang it, I need to push, uh, I need to push the, uh, Y button and throw the thing out to give myself a little extra speed at that jump. But God dang it. Oh, well, I'll let this place so we can see the, uh, connection of the opening of the new places. And then I will be right back to, uh, a point in which we will, uh, return getting, uh, you know the golden flag. But anyway, doing that will unlock our second half of Bowser World there, um, which there are, of course, as you can see, m many more levels. Ooh, that level with the thwomps, and we see another plusy level up there. But anyway, guys, I'm going to head back in here. I'll meet you guys at the end when we're about to do our jump to the gold flag. So see you guys in a second. Yeah! There we go, ladies and gentlemen, we got it! Gold flag has been obtained as Mini Mario. <laughs> That's pretty hilarious to see him like that. Anyway, guys, there we have it. Um, and uh, with that, we are going to end off this episode of uh, Super Mario 3D World. And I will see you guys back tomorrow with uh, yet another episode uh, where we complete a few more levels here at World Bowser. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for joining me on this installment of our 3D adventure. From me to you, have a very nice day. And I will see you guys next time.